Yo, what's the YouTube? It's your boy Neezy HD back with another video, man. And as y'all can see, bro, from the title of this video, basically, I'm gonna be showing y'all another step by step tutorial on how to make three modded outfits this time using clothing glitches. Um, these ones are camo based, body armor based, uh, glitched outfits. Um, and yeah. Basically, I'm just be showing y'all exactly how to make them. If y'all enjoyed this video and the last one and want to see more of these types of videos or more GTA 5 content in general, man, or if y'all just enjoying my videos in general, man, make sure y'all smash that like button, man. Hit that subscribe button, share with a friend. Leave a comment down below if you're feeling good today, man. And with that being said, let's go ahead and hop into the video. All right, y'all, so for the first outfit, man, what you gonna wanna do is make sure you head, make your way down to the casino. Once you're down to the casino, man, you wanna head to the clothing section, go to tops, scroll down to hoodies, and then you're gonna wanna scroll down until you see neon waterproof. Now, after that, you're gonna take your black ass out of the casino, head down to the nearest clothing store, go over to bottoms, uh, or jeans, rather, and then scroll until now for this one you could really go with multiple jeans uh you could go with the black fitted or you could go with the gray fitted as you can see i decided to go with the gray fitted also shoes a lot of alternatives you could go with uh you could go white and blue i think it was gray and blue and black and blue but um like i said all of them will go good with this outfit but me personally i chose to go with something i've never seen before which is the blueprint light ups All right, man, now once you selected your shoes, you're gonna wanna go over to back to tops, uh, scroll down to utility vest, and you're gonna wanna scroll until you see the blue and gray straps vest. As you can see, it goes perfectly with the uh, jacket underneath, same exact color. After you choose that, you're gonna wanna go over to accessories, go to gloves and choose any gloves that you're liking. For me, I thought the black tack gloves went with this the best. Now once you choose your gloves, you're gonna wanna go back to hats, and uh, for this one, I went with the blue sweat box broker or the blue sweat box snapback, sorry, uh, which you'll see in a moment. Um, it is the exact same blue, it seems like. So that's why I went with it. But, you know, like I said, uh, you guys could choose any hat of your choice. After you do that, pull up your interaction menu, go to style and turn or put your hood up. And once you do all of this, you can go ahead and save this outfit. All right, man, now after you have the outfit saved, what you wanna do is scroll down to outfits, heist coveralls, and choose any of these outfits right here with the quarantine mask. And um, go ahead and make your way down to the nearest telescope. All right, man, once you get to the nearest telescope, we are gonna be doing the telescope glitch. As you can see, uh, I didn't get it first try, but um, you know, just try again until you get it. Right here, I got it. Um, so once you see that your player is on the telescope and his mask is still on, Pull up your interaction menu and go to the outfit that we just saved. Click on it, walk away, and you'll see the mask is now glitched onto the outfit. Once you see this, you're just gonna wanna make your way down to the uh, mask shop and save this outfit. Okay, boom. Now, once you save this outfit, uh, all you wanna do is pull up your interaction menu, accessories, parachute, and put the parachute on, and boom. This right here is the full outfit um, in action. Now there is an alternative to this outfit, which I'm gonna show you guys right now. Um, we're gonna go ahead and glitch the duffel bag on. So if you have an outfit with the duffel bag, go ahead and put that on. Uh, if you don't, I'll leave a link down below to the description. But once you uh, fly up high enough in the air, you're gonna wanna jump off, pull your parachute and pull up your interaction menu. And uh, as soon as you see your character land, boom, right there, you're gonna wanna click on the outfit as he's taking the parachute off. Click on the outfit and you'll see that it's now glitched onto the outfit. The only downside about this alternative is that the, the mask will come off uh, as you can see, but you know, it's up to y'all whichever way y'all wanna rock it. And yeah, this is the first outfit. All right, y'all boys. Now for the second outfit, what you're gonna wanna do is already have the black joggers. If you don't, there will be a link down below in the description to get them. But once you have them on, go ahead and head down to the casino, go over to clothing, hoodies, and scroll down until you see the uh, 
purple waterproof hoodie. Now, once you have this hoodie on, you're gonna wanna go ahead and leave the casino and head down to the nearest clothing store. Once you're at the nearest clothing store, you're gonna wanna go ahead and walk in, go over back to tops and put on the vest. So scroll down to utility vest and scroll until you see the purple straps vest. As you see, it goes perfect with the hoodie again. Um, after you have that on, go over to shoes, canvas shoes. And for this one, I went with the purple low canvas. Uh, I thought they looked really good with this outfit. After you have your shoes situated, you're gonna wanna walk over to accessories, go to gloves and throw on your gloves. Uh, for this outfit, I definitely went with the white cotton gloves. Um, I thought white gloves was the way to go with this outfit. Didn't want too much black. I wanted some white incorporated. Now, once you do this, you don't wanna save the outfit. You wanna go ahead and leave, head down to the nearest, uh, sorry, head down to the mask shop and go ahead and equip your mask. Uh, for this one, I went to Balaclavas and I chose this nice white designer looking mask, uh, Dieter Shosh Balaclava. And now after you have your mask put on, now you wanna go ahead and pull up your interaction menu, go to style, go to hood and turn the hood up. Now save this outfit. All right, man, now after you have the outfit saved, what you're gonna wanna do is we're gonna be doing the telescope glitch next. So you're gonna hop on your oppressor, head down to the telescope. If your player uh, hood comes off, you just wanna turn it back up before you do the glitch. Now run across the telescope, hit right on the D-pad. You see your player stand here like a bot. And then once you see him standing like a bot, pull up your interaction menu, go to accessories, go to glasses. And you wanna select any black glasses. Uh, me personally, I went with the Mono Outlaw goggles. I thought they looked the most badass. And boom, you now have the purple straps outfit, man. This shit looks really nice to me. I thought this personally was my favorite one. Um, but we're not done yet. So once you have this on, you're gonna wanna head back to the mask shop. Uh, like I said, if he takes the hood off, just turn it back up again and um, now what you want to do is throw on the parachute. So go to style, parachute, throw it on. And boom, this is the outfit completely done. Um, once you have it looking like this, you can go ahead and save the outfit. Or you could take the parachute off and just rock it like this, which is how I did. Um, and yeah. All right, y'all, now for the final outfit of this video, man, you're gonna wanna make sure you have the khaki joggers already. If you don't, I will leave a link down below in the description. Um, once you have that, you're gonna wanna go ahead and head to the clothing store, go over to the top section, scroll down to utility vest, and scroll until you see, I believe it's called the salmon plate carrier. Yes, the salmon plate carrier. Uh, once you have that selected, you wanna head over to the shoe section go down to uh, rubberized boots and or no sorry yes rubberized boots and you're gonna want to scroll down until you see the kind of like black and khaki ones these right here black and light brown trail once you have those selected go over to accessories and throw on your gloves for these I went with the black driving gloves I uh, just want to switch it up just a little bit and after you have your gloves uh, you're gonna want to go ahead and save this outfit now, I actually did this backwards, but uh, what you're going to want to do is next go to the casino. You guys could have uh, started out at the casino and put on the hoodie here first and then went to the clothes store, but it's okay. If you want to do it this way, uh, head down to the casino. Once you get to the casino, you're going to want to run to the clothing section, uh, go over to uh, hoodies and select the black. It's one of, no, sorry. Liquorice Waterproof is gonna be 39 out of 49. You wanna select that. And after this, you're gonna wanna head back out of the casino and head down to the nearest clothing store. Now, once you're at the nearest clothing store again, um, what you're gonna wanna do is scroll, go over to hats and go over to Arena War hats and select the uh, piss washer, the black piss washer cap. As you can see, the colors coordinate perfectly. Once you do that, pull up your interaction menu, go to style, uh, hood, turn the hood up. Now, once you have the outfit put together like this, you wanna go ahead and save this outfit.
All right, y'all. Now, after you save the outfit, what you're gonna want to do is scroll down to outfits, heist coveralls, and again, select any of these outfits here with the quarantine mask. Once you do that, we are gonna be doing the telescope glitch again, as you may have guessed. So just head down to the pier, uh, run by the telescope right on the D-pad. Once you see him standing like a bot, pull up your interaction menu, go to style and select the outfit we just made. Boom, click it, walk away. Boom, now the mask is glitched on, but we're not done yet. This is just the base part of the outfit. Once you got this, run over to the mask shop and save this outfit. All right, y'all, now once you have this outfit saved, you're gonna wanna head down to this specific Binko clothing right by the strip club. Once you do this, you're gonna wanna head to the front counter, go to outfits and scroll down to outfits flight suits and select the black flight suit. Now, once you have this outfit on, you're gonna wanna go ahead and walk your black ass to the motherfucking vanilla unicorn right here. And um, as soon as you get to the strip club, uh, you're gonna wanna pull up your interaction menu. As soon as you walk in, pull up your interaction menu, go to style, uh, click on the outfit twice so that the mask can appear, walk out and boom, you should see this, uh, what do you call it? This tube glitched onto the outfit. Now you can add the parachute as the final topping on the cake and you have your glitched outfit right here. Number three, I call this Desert Assassin. Uh, y'all might see this in the top 10 outfits video coming next week. Let me know if y'all want that to be in there. And um, yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. If y'all enjoyed, make sure you smash that like button, man, subscribe. And yeah, that being said, it's been your boy Neezy and I'm out, peace.